The $450 million Gateway District construction is still very much underway over in Lawrence. Today, KU Athletic Director Travis Goff provided some updates as to how it's going. And good news, Jayhawk fans, it's perfectly on schedule to be done in early August 2025. I stopped by to get a closer look at the West and North rebuilds. We know this means the Jayhawks will be calling Kansas City home this season. Both non-conference games at Children's Mercy Park are about sold out at this point. That capacity is 25,000, but their four conference games at Arrowhead will obviously have a lot more seats to be filled. 76,000 to be exact. Goff says if 76,000 is the limit, then 76,000 is what they expect to have. We want an incredible home field advantage, um, and we want to do everything possible to maximize that, and we want to maximize student attendance. And then we certainly want to expose new people to Kansas football. We haven't really put a ceiling on that. We know, you know, somebody had maybe made some assumption or suggestion, hey, let's just play down there with the lower bowl and shut down the upper. No, our aspirations are, f are far greater than that. We want that upper bowl feeling, looking the part of what this program deserves. Only a month and four days till the first game of the season. And today the program announced how it plans to